what's up all my lovely wolves out there i know it's been a long time since i decided to make video i've been occupied and not home a lot lately as you can see from the background this is like a raw as video i decided today i was gonna do a q a because um i haven't been getting ready much lately honestly um i'll do it here and there and that's why I post pictures on my Instagram. So if you guys don't follow my Instagram, go follow that if you guys want to see pictures of my eyeshadow looks. Um, but yeah, the other day, I think it was yesterday, I decided to post on my makeup Instagram and my regular Instagram and on Snapchat um, questions that you guys want me to answer and i got quite a few of them the only good ones that was like kind of like oh my god i don't even know how to answer that was my cousin he asked me like something that i honestly didn't like i think about my goals but not like so much but we'll get to that so yeah if you guys want um to see this q a of course keep on watching Okay, so the first question is, what made you like country music? Um, I don't know if I've gotten into this in my other YouTube videos, but... Ooh, a couple years back, I want to say 2017? Fudge and crackers, I don't remember. Either 2017, 2018, I went through a rough patch in my life with, of course, you guys know a lot about my depression and my anxiety because I talk about it a lot. Um, I was going through a really rough patch and it was a dark time for me. I was always in bed, um, really depressed, just constantly cutting myself, um, listening to like very sad music. And I remember I decided to go on Pandora and just put on acoustic um, music songs. I don't remember what it was, what station it was. And uh, Chris Stapleton, Tennessee Whiskey came on. And it was it for me. Ever since then, it's my all-time favorite song besides Cover Me Up from Morgan Wallen. Oh my gosh. The song. I can listen to it every single day. But both Tennessee Whiskey and Cover Me Up are like my all-time favorite country music songs. Uh, but yeah, um, Tennessee Whiskey became my go-to. And so I decided to put Chris Stapleton and Tennessee Whiskey on Pandora. And well, I started discovering a lot of country music and I realized how much like country music really gets to me. And it, honestly, it's what I listen to the most. If I'm not around my best friend, of course. Um, second question is, do you believe in karma? I... 100%. I believe in karma 100%. Third question is, short hair or long hair? That's a hard question. Because right now, currently, I have semi-short. It's growing out. I cut it a while back. But currently, I am missing my long hair very, very much. I had short hair for a while now. And uh, I have my phases of having long hair and then wanting to go back to short and then wanting to go back to long. And now I'm in my phase where I want to go back to long. And... If you guys don't follow me on my social media, which one of them is Twitter, I did like a little rant about how my sister had said that me and short hair, blonde short hair, yeah, long black hair, yeah, and right now I look like Lord Farquaad. Fuck this. Um, fourth question is, do you wear makeup every day? No, I don't. 
as you can see right now I have the most naturalist look ever which is literally just my eyebrows and mascara I kind of go to this look most of the time now um honestly I don't um here and there sometimes I wear makeup to work but this look not like a going out look on the weekends um well since i work friday and saturday not really but sunday i'll i'll do makeup looks but it's very rare honestly i don't um wear makeup as much as i used to um because i just been a homebody lately um fifth question is tacos or sofas i hard honestly tacos but it also depends on from where because I'm very picky when it comes to my tacos so eh, um they're good for me but it's just very rare when I want them so I think I'm, I'm tacos is for it's that's that's the answer the fifth question is what are your life goals and this is a question that my cousin asked me you know i don't for a while like i used to always think about the future and what i wanted and i would set those goals but then i felt like every time i set them like i was for a couple weeks i'd be like okay i'm gonna do it i'm gonna do it and didn't happen so I kind of just constantly live on a day-to-day -day basis. But if I was to talk about like what are my life goals, at least one of them is to become big in YouTube. That's one of them, of course. Which I know I need to stay consistent on these videos. And uh, second is to become a veterinary. Um, not just for like domestic animals of course i want to become big like helping wild animals but at least those are like the two goals that i do want to accomplish in life besides uh raising a good man as my child talking about my child Seventh question is, what do you wish to accomplish in your life? Well, which is basically what are your life goals, yeah. Like I said, I do want to become big on YouTube. Not because of the financial part of it. Mostly because I feel like I'm very raw when it comes to my depression and my anxiety. And I'm, I just want to be able to help people out there when it comes to personal things. Because I feel like I've been through a lot in the last couple years of my life. <laughs> um, and a lot of people don't like to talk about it. A lot of people like to sugarcoat things on social media and make it seem like it's the easiest thing to do. It's not. So, like I said, YouTube is one of, my, one of the things I want to accomplish in life. Like I said going back to school and getting that career done is another one mm. the next question is how long have you been doing makeup holy moly it's um. a tough question I want to say okay so First started doing my makeup around 15, I want to say. My mom had this like package of bare minerals that came with just powders. It wasn't too much, but I think I want to say 15. It's when I started 14 or 15. And then I started getting makeup from Rite Aid. And so I started doing my makeup. I would cake on my face so much. I remember that. 
and then around 2010 which I was 15 16, 16 I started doing eyeshadow looks because uh at the time I was already with my son's father and his mom decided to give me an eyeshadow palette and ever since then like I would start doing eyeshadow looks um I wasn't the best I think I've mentioned it and if you follow my Instagram my makeup Instagram you would see the difference between 2010 till now big difference so I want to say about 10 years 10 years I've been doing makeup still have a lot to learn though next question is what's your full name and how old are you I am 25 turned 26 in August and my full name is Karina Munoz. Uh, next question is, what's your favorite animal? Whoever asked this question is, Bing. no offense, but if you follow my Instagram, of course, like I've mentioned, a lot of my quotes are wolf quotes. My username is a La Loba, which is She Wolf. On my bio says She Wolf. Um, on one of my other YouTube videos, which kind of answers my question if you've been watching my videos or not. Um, it shows what's my favorite animal, which is a wolf. Wolf is my favorite animal. Like I said in my videos, my last video, on one of my videos on YouTube. My text tone is a wolf howling. My backgrounds are wolves. And my pop socket has a wolf and it says mama. Yeah, a wolf is my favorite animal. And next question is, what is your dream holiday? I'm not big on Christmas or Thanksgiving. New Year's, my favorite is Halloween, of course. There, have, there still is a year where I need to dress up, which hopefully this year I can do it. And hopefully this year I can do like Halloween looks. If I actually set my mind to it. There's a lot of things I want to accomplish this year, which I am not going to talk about because I want to do it secretly, secretly, and hopefully I can accomplish it. But my dream holiday is this year I want to go all out for Christmas. I don't really celebrate Christmas with my family. Um, it's very rare, honestly. Um, we kind of never really celebrated Christmas together. So this year I kind of, whether it's hopefully in our home or we can rent out a cabin, but I want to have all of my siblings, all of the, like my close family and just kind of like wear onesies and play drinking games or whatever games we can play and just enjoy each other's company been a while since we've actually had like a family get together like that um but yeah that's my dream holiday this year at least but when it comes to holidays i'm big on halloween i love scary shit <sighs> last question is do you want more kids hmm. yes and no if you were to like right now me answering no I don't want more kids but then I do have moments where I do want more kids um I guess it's just being with the right person being stable maybe yeah but at least at the moment no because i think about it and i'm like my son's about to be nine this year yeah i know i had him young my son's about to be nine years this year by the time i have another kid which is not anytime soon 
you know my son's gonna be a teenager probably by the time i find out that i'm having another kid and having to go through the whole process again it's kind of scary but at least at the moment no i don't want no more kids but who knows a lot of things a lot of things can change so quien sabe but yeah, those are the questions that were asked. There was a lot of other questions that were asked, but those are questions that I am not going to bring onto my YouTube channel because I have some pretty disgusting friends sometimes. Um, but yeah, hopefully I can start um, actually making more videos, whether it's here or at home. But... I decided to make this video here today because of the fact that at home I have a full house and I never have like free space to be able to record. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to do it here. So yeah, um, like I said, um, there's a lot of things I want to accomplish this year and one of them is picking up my slack on YouTube video. I know I say it every single video, but the fact that I have people that like support this and I'm slacking is kind of upsetting to me, you know, like, so I kind of want to start like picking up that slack. So yeah, um, like I said, this is the q and i I'm sorry for going in my and coming back and going in my and coming back, but I'm going to keep on trying. Um, hopefully my next video... I can do a contour look because I know my white girl wanted how to contour your face because she said she has a very round face and I've been meaning to do looks. I know Valentine's Day is coming, but you know, I personally don't like celebrating it because who cares about love when you got money? That's all I'm saying. Um, it's tax season, people. Tax season. Not love season. But yeah, so um, if you have any suggestions for my videos, you know what to do. Leave a comment below. Um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe. Um, like if you liked and enjoyed this video. And if you didn't, well, you can suck up. Just kidding. Um, but yeah. Sorry for the lighting if it's not the best. And I think that's it. Um, like I've said before, I'm going to be dropping all my social media links down below. Um, I do have two Instagram now, two Instagram pages now, which is one that's completely devoted to makeup looks. The second one is more my personal one, which I did have private for a while, but then I decided, you know what, for what? So... I have that. I deactivated my Facebook. I just kind of wanted to just let that go. But I do have a Twitter and Snapchat. And I will be linking those below. So you guys can follow. And yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.